Childhood ends prematurely for many refugee children around the world. A large proportion of the world's 100 million refugees are children under the age of 18, fleeing war and persecution with their families or alone, struggling to survive their childhood as they move from one place to another, a future full of uncertainty. Today, we are visiting the Mar Elias camp, a small camp located in southern Beirut, hosting Palestinian refugees, but also a notable Syrian population. As we approach Children's Day on June 1st, we aim to see how refugee children live in this camp and the daily challenges they face while learning more about their dreams and aspirations in life. While the narrow streets of this densely populated camp have been painted in bright colors where children spend most of their time outside playing and laughing, infrastructural decay is easily visible where there are no public spaces for leisure or recreational activities. Still, the refugee camp is not only a place of frustration and helplessness, but also a place of yearning for a better life. Children in this camp dream of a better future. لما أكبر بحب أطلع دكتور ما عشان بحب أساعد الناس. Lebanon remains the country hosting the largest number of refugees per capita, with the government estimating that 1.5 million Syrian refugees and over 200,000 Palestinian refugees live in more than a thousand camps scattered around the country. Refugees suffer from dire living conditions in Lebanon and the country's financial collapse made things much worse for Syrian refugees, namely. Thousands of Syrian children are engaged in child labor, and one out of five girls between the age of 15 and 19 were married, a trend that has been present for the last three years. <laughs> 